Well, howdy YouTube, thanks for stopping by. Today, we're down in the big thicket part of Texas. We're at Village Creek State Park. Howdy YouTube, thanks for stopping by at Dude RV. Hey, if this is your first visit, please remember to click on the subscribe button and hit that bell as well. You don't want to miss another episode of the Dude RV Traveling Adventure Show. Today, we're down in the big thicket part of Texas. That is Southeast Texas. We're at Village Creek State Park. I got a little red. I got the GoPro. Best of all, I got you. So let's go take a ride through Village Creek State Park. All right. We are ready. So cue the music. So Village Creek State Park. It's not a real huge park, but man, it is a pretty one. We're in the big thicket area, which, I mean, all you have to do is look over here at the side of the road and you can see why they call it the big thicket. This part of Texas receives more annual rainfall than the, cast, the, the temperate rainforests in the Pacific Northwest. Lots of rain, so everything is green, green, green and damn we are right i think we're still inside the city limits of the town community city of lumberton texas population 1100 and change but you can buy all your no i'm sorry 10,000 not 1,000 10,000 10,000 people live in lumberton Here we are at the check-in. They have a nature center, which you'll have to go to the, F, the experiential video to see that. Now we're gonna cruise through the only RV camping loop in the park. There's only 22 sites. So plan ahead. Make your reservations early. All the sites are, you know, they're pretty close together, but most of them have got some brush screen between them. Your dump station there on the left. And then the shower facility. Looks relatively new, it's right there. Back out on the main road. Now we're going to head down to the day use area, which is on the banks of Village Creek. A village, no, a lot of the length of Village Creek is in a national preserve. Oh, that was bumpy. And that would be the uh, Big Thicket National Preserve. There's a paddling trail on Village Creek. It's uh, 22 miles long. Hopefully on our visit, we're here for two days, and we hope to get over to the uh, National Preserve Visitor Center. Although the weather's supposed to turn Less than favorable tomorrow. Looks like they had a big burn here. The 
nice lady that checked me in at the front gate. She said they don't uh, have a whole lot of pavement in the park because it floods so frequently. So we can't rag on TxDOT for the gravel road. Good thing I put a new front tire on Little Red. We need all the traction we can get. The cabin area is closed. Venomous snakes and poisonous plants exist in this park. I think that brings us to the end of the road here at Village Creek State Park. Of course, we're not gonna I'm not gonna end this video without letting you get a look at Village Creek. And there you have it, Village Creek. Looks more like Village River. All right, if you enjoyed our little run through Village Creek State Park, I sure appreciate you giving me a thumbs up and sharing me on your social media platforms. Thank you so much for following along. For those of you who have been following along, man, I am so deeply honored. Thank you very much. That's why I do what I do. All right, with that being said, y'all come back now, you hear?